So, it's is the turn of uh, Timothy O'Connor that wrote uh, a very m crucial and seminal entry of the Stanford Encyclopedia of Philosophy mm. about emergent properties. Uh, and it is a, a leading scholar about uh, uh, this, um, uh, this field. And uh, so we will ask, uh, we, we, we will listen uh, to, to Timothy tomorrow morning, but uh, now uh, we ask him uh, something of, uh, about the importance of emergence for uh, everyday life of people. So um, we inhabit one unified world, uh, but there are many different sciences that seek to understand uh, aspects of that world. Uh, using different tools and methods. Um, and uh, many of these sciences are directed at um, objects and processes at very different scales. So some sciences study the smallest constituents of, of the world, fundamental physics. Some study the, the grand cosmic scale. And most sciences are directed at objects and processes that are somewhere in between the smallest and the largest. So uh, plants and animals, rocks, uh, earthquakes, volcanoes, uh, the, 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 the sorts of things that we immediately just see around us um, and that are on a kind of human-sized scale. So the topic of emergence then is how do all of these different entities fit together into one unified world. Um, you might ask, why is there anything other than the things physics studies? Since after all, physics concerns um, the, the, the raw materials out of which everything is constituted. So why, why do we need uh, uh, any more science other than just simple physics? Um, why, why, what, what's the significance of the, these middle-sized sciences? And in particular, because we all care about ourselves, we're all, we all uh, wonder about our place within the cosmos. Um, the question of emergence um, raises issues about the significance of human persons, whether or not we make some kind of fundamental difference to the way reality unfolds, or whether in some sense we are a derivative phenomena that in principle could be understood in, in purely subpersonal terms.